I have always enjoyed visiting wineries during family holidays. When I saw the ad in the paper for the job here, I saw it as, as a chance to follow one of my passions. After some research, I applied and got an interview. The owners were impressed that I knew so much about their wines, I got the job. How are we guys? Good, Good. thanks. Good, down here on holidays? Yeah, we're down from Perth for the week. Okay, let's try some wines. These are the wines that we have available for tasting today. Uh, we have some whites and some reds. This is the tasting order that we recommend. We'll start off with our Madfish Premium White. It's easy to find. It's bottle shops, restaurants, cafes, widely available. So whereabouts in Perth are you guys from? We're from Mummy. This is the bottle, is it here? Yeah. Okay, yeah, I think I've had it at a restaurant okay. before. But some people might find it a little bit too sweet. Okay, we'll move on to something that's, that's a little bit drier. Uh, this is our Semillon Savion Blanc. It's uh, a little bit dry and it's got a little bit crisper acid. My job is more PR than actually selling wine. The most important thing is making sure people that come to our cellar door have an enjoyable time. If you go into a bottle shop and see 30 wines that you tasted in Margaret River, you're not going to remember every wine. But if you had a good time at a particular winery, then chances are you will remember that wine. Oh, that's much better. Good? Yeah. Our visitors don't have to hear all about the wine. They don't have to read the notes. They can just taste it, and if they like it, they can buy some. I will tell them where they can get it. There's no pressure to buy. Meeting and talking to new people every day is one of the best parts of my job. So what's the best wine that you have here at yeah, this winery? Okay. Wine is such a personal thing. Um, it's more about whatever works for you best. It's not how much the wine costs, um, how long it can be cellared. Um, it's just a purely personal thing. You just really have to find what you like and what style you like best. Hey Brett. How are you Steve? How'd it go this morning? Yeah, good. We had some big groups in, a lot of young people for school holidays, yeah. I think. Thought it looked busy. Yeah. Have you had a chance to do the internet orders yet? No, not yet. Uh, as soon as I finish polishing these glasses, I'll jump in there and see if we've got anything. Every morning we taste test the wines we open to make sure there are no problems. We take orders from all over Australia via our website. I wonder if any came in overnight. We also have merchandise that needs to be accounted for. And once a month we stock take our merchandise. Okay, so four complete rows of 16. And there's 14 on top. At the start and end of each day, we do a wine stock take to make sure that all the wines we have tasted, sold or shipped are accounted for. How are you, Matty? Hey, Brett. How you going, mate? Good, man. Just having a look at a few wines? Yeah, just having a look at the 03 Scottsdale Shiraz. Oh, yeah. Come on. Any chance I could have a taste? Yeah, mate. No worries. So, it's been barrel now for probably oh, maybe 16 months. Um, so we're just looking for, yeah, some nice fresh fruit characters. Okay, and what was the 03 vintage like? Um, it was good, especially in the Great Southern. Um, Shiraz for the Great Southern is, is a good variety. What do you reckon? Yeah, it's coming up good. I think it's um, got some good characters already. But um, I don't think, yeah, it won't be too long. We'll get her out probably in another four weeks, ready for bottling. So from here, yeah. just a little bit of fining or more blending? Yeah, a little bit of... Egg I'm very happy where I work. Um, the pay is good and the hours are flexible. I can see myself doing this for a few more years and then considering my options.